One of the great things about the Amazon Fire tablets is how well it simply integrates all of Amazon's services into one affordable, convenient device. That, unsurprisingly, includes Alexa and Smart Assistant skills. In fact, with something called Show Mode, you can turn your Amazon Fire HD tablet into an Echo Show of sorts, thus making it a hub for all of your smart home products and asking it to do anything you would use an Echo Show for. I'm Cam Bunton from Pocket Lint, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to do it. And if you do find this video useful, please do leave a thumbs up, subscribe and tap the notification bell and then you won't miss any more of our uploads. So first you need to check you have a compatible tablet. If you have a Fire HD 8 or a Fire HD 10, those are the 8 inch and 10 inch tablets respectively, you're good to go as long as you have a model from the last four years. It's supported by the seventh generation or later of both models. If you have the smaller Fire 7, sadly it's not compatible at this point in time. So the first mode I'm going to show you is just activating it manually and simply because there are a couple of ways to enable show mode manually and it's really simple too. Just swipe down from the top of the screen when it's in landscape mode and toggle the little switch that says show mode. Now you'll see the interface change to be exactly like an Echo Show. To switch it off you just find that toggle again and switch it back off. Easy. Or you can ask Alexa to switch to show mode just using your voice. Say your wake word and then switch to show mode and then to stop say exit show mode. You can also get the tablet to do it automatically if you have the right wireless charger. If you have the wireless charging dock for the Fire tablet, you can also activate a feature that allows you to enable show mode automatically whenever the tablet is docked. Open the settings on the tablet and find show mode. Now toggle on the option that says automatic mode switching if it isn't on already. Now once you know how to enable show mode, you also need to know how to customize it and there are a lot of options here. And a lot of the customization options for show mode are exactly the same as they are on an actual Echo Show. So if you open your settings and head to show mode and then head into the home screen settings, you can change the background. This can feature a slideshow of nature, travel, art or other default wallpapers. You also get the option to pick photos from Amazon or Facebook photo albums. Dig into the Alexa settings in the same menu and you can change how you interact with Alexa too, whether you want to change the wake word or disable voice activation entirely. And you can also add subtitles for responses in the accessibility menu. Now another option that's available to you is making it sound better because of course an Echo Show, an actual Echo Show, has a big speaker built in where your tablet doesn't. But thankfully you have a 3.5mm port so you can just plug it into a better speaker. Or if you want to, use Bluetooth and connect wirelessly to a Bluetooth speaker, even an Echo speaker if you want to. So what can you actually do in show mode? Well, one of the good things about show mode is that in a way, if you're on the fence about spending the money on an actual Echo show, this gives you a really good experience of what it's like to have an actual Echo show without actually having one. If you drag the arrow from the right across to the left, you get access to the main menu. Here you'll find card suggestions and things to do like setting reminders or creating a shopping list things that the Echo Show will allow you to do as well. Or if you tap Smart Home, you get to your big touchscreen controls for connected smart home products. The Communicate tab lets you send messages or drop in and out of other Alexa devices like Echoes in other rooms of your house, or you can make an announcement across all of them. The alarms and music options are really self-explanatory and routines is where you can activate existing routines that you've set up already. So it is essentially like having your own Echo Show that isn't an Echo Show. And it's a good way to utilize an old Fire tablet if you're not really using it as a tablet anymore. You can just turn it into a smart home hub instead. If you found this video useful, please do let me know in the comments down below and give me a thumbs up. Subscribe and tap the notification bell and then you don't miss any more of our videos. I'll see you again in the next one. Bye for now.